Today I'm going to show you how to thread a needle. The things that you need to thread a needle is a pair of shears, a spool of thread, and of course a needle. When you're threading the needle, you want to make sure you don't have too much thread, but just enough. So I usually say about two feet of thread, and I usually use for my students this table as a guide about the width of the table is about two feet. So you unroll the spool of thread until it's about the length of the table, or two feet, and then you're going to cut it off. When you're cutting the thread, you want to cut it at about a 45 degree angle, which is like this, and that'll make it easier to thread your needle. So once you've done that, you can set those to the side. When you're getting ready to thread the needle, I usually suggest holding the thread in whatever hand you write with. So you want to uh, hold it really close to the end. If you have it too far back, like this, it creates too much slack and it makes it very difficult to feed it through because the thread constantly is bending. So you want to make sure you hold it right near the end like this. Um, also, when you're holding the needle in your left hand, you want to hold it so you can see right through the eye or the little hole of the needle, which makes it easier to push it through there. So as you're getting ready to thread it, you hold the thread right up to the eye and you feed it through and then grab it and bring both of the ends together. So once you have them together, then you would be ready to knot your needle. And that's how you thread a needle.